I want to talk to you in a moment about the principle of authenticity. Hi, my name is John Maxwell. Welcome to Minute with Maxwell. In a leadership discussion recently, I shared with the audience that I felt that uh, authenticity was the new standard of leadership. Now, when I was a young leader, that wasn't true. Position was, or uh, uh, having, a, having a sense of power was, but I think that it's all changing now. Uh, we, we, I don't think people want a perfect leader, but I do think that they want an authentic leader. So, so what does that mean? It means that you and I are who we say we are, uh, we're comfortable in our own skin, uh, that we're not only true to ourselves, but because we're true to ourselves, we're true to the people that we lead and share with. It means that we have a, a sense of uh, humility, and that humility allows us to understand our limitations as well as our strengths. And it also gives us permission to ask people to come into our life, to speak into our life, to help us, to give us advice. We're constantly looking for better ways to, to improve ourselves. I would hope that uh, more than anything else is you would just strive to, to be the person that you should become. In another discussion recently, I was asked about uh, making hard decisions. And I spoke in the fact that as a young leader, there were five hard decisions I made that have held me steady today and I think allowed me to be authentic. I'll give you one right now. I made a decision when I was about 32 to be willing to be misunderstood and lonely for the right reason. Now, I think a lot of leaders, <laughs> they're lonely for wrong reasons. In fact, the expression is lonely at the top doesn't mean sometimes you're a leader, just sometimes means you've got a personality disorder, okay? And you've got relationship issues and you really need some help in those areas. So being lonely doesn't mean you're a leader. I know a lot of lonely people, they don't lead anything. They just have bad personalities. But when we talk about being lonely at the top, we talk about being a lonely leader. I just made a decision as a very young leader that there would be times I knew that it would be lonely and there would be times that I knew I would be misunderstood. But at those times, I wanted to be not because I had a bad personality or that I treated someone wrong or I didn't process it correctly. I wanted to be because I did the right thing. And people sometimes just don't understand the right thing and so they leave you alone. I think that's authenticity. I think authenticity, again, is being true to yourself so that you can be true to the people that you lead. I'm glad you're with me today on Minute with Maxwell.